Peel and remove the entire release liner from the back of the mask. Discard the release liner. Hold the respirator horizontally in front of your face. Keep the printed portion of the mask on the bottom with the colored side facing out. Position the center of the top of the mask just below the bridge of your nose. Using your index fingers, begin sealing the top of the mask by pressing along the sides of your nose first and then outward horizontally across the tops of your cheekbones toward your ears. Press firmly to ensure complete adhesion to your skin. Keep the top border of the mask horizontal and not sloping downward. Starting at the top corners of the respirator, slide your fingers down the sides of your face. Seal the sides of the mask to your cheeks until your fingers come together under your chin. As the mask comes together under your chin, pinch the mask together with your fingers and press up under your chin. Make sure the mask is sealed completely under your chin. Hold the bottom of the mask near your neck. Pull to one side toward your ear. Firmly press the entire bottom of the mask upward into the bottom of your chin to assure a good seal. Repeat on the other side. The bottom of the mask must be sealed to itself along the entire length. A tab should be formed under the chin. See proper fit on the left. If a tab cannot be formed along the entire bottom, see improper fit on the right, a larger mask may be needed. All adhesive surfaces along the tab should be aligned and sealed to each other. Starting at the top of your nose, retrace the entire border of the mask with your fingers, firmly pressing the adhesive seal of the mask to your skin. Check the areas around your nose to ensure that the mask is sealed to the skin around the creases of the nose. Check the underside of your chin to make sure the edges of the mask are sealed together and to your skin. Breathe in and out deeply. You should not feel any air leaking around the edges of the mask. If necessary, seal any leaks by applying pressure to those areas until the leaks have stopped. Retrace the entire border of the mask with your fingers one more time, firmly pressing the adhesive seal of the mask to your skin. If you cannot achieve a proper, leak-free fit, do not enter a contaminated area. If you suspect a leak has occurred, leave the contaminated area. To remove the mask, grab the mask by the tab at the bottom and pull up and away from your face. 